is this? Baby, we children of summer. We're meant to be free. Party, we're not like the others. No wow. reason to be. A little nervous. I heard there's a dinosaur back here. Hi, friends. We are so glad you're with us again today. This is actually us from the future. <laughs> I love when that happens. <laughs> yeah. We were at Wall Drug here a while back, and we recorded some footage of us visiting with you. You were with us, but then I don't know if I didn't hit record or lost it or whatever, um, but we don't have it. So, redo. <laughs> anyway, we wanted to tell you just about a couple things about Wall Drug. We know there's a million Wall Drug videos out there, um, but there's a couple things that maybe you don't know that we thought we would share. And one of them is, is Wall Drug good for kids yeah which our grandkids absolutely loved it. yeah so much fun so a lot of you guys aren't even traveling with kids but if oh, you are Atlanta. traveling with small children maybe you've got your grandkids or are you kids with you yes it's good for kids so we're gonna show you a little bit of footage of that there's the splash pad there's the giant dinosaur arcade um, there's some a lot of fun little photo ops for the kids and things for them to oh, that climb was for on. The kids? I thought that was for the adults. Well, okay. we actually okay. did see a lot of adults climbing up on the um, what's that called? Like a jackalope? Yeah, jackalope. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so fun for all ages. <laughs> What is this? The second thing was a surprise to us because it's brand new. About two blocks, would you say? About two blocks say. behind Wall Drug is a new doll chainsaw art. And I say new because doll, they're two brothers. Their last name is Doll. I don't remember their first name, but they're chainsaw artists and they've got um, gorgeous, huge shops in like outdoor shops in Keystone and Hill City and Deadwood, actually. And we went to all of them because I'm a sucker for chainsaw art. But very cool, they have a brand new one, brand new one in Wall, South Dakota. So if you're a little unsure, should I go to Wall Drug? Should I not? Yeah, pop in there. And if it's not your thing, go behind and check out Doll Chainsaw Art because right. it's very cool. It is. It's got what, 70 foot tall art there? Yeah, like the jackalope that you can actually walk up to the top of Into inside. The brain of. You can yeah. see inside the working of the brain. <laughs> That's not disturbing at all. <laughs> okay, I'm going all the way to the top. Hi. Oh my goodness, are you all the way up there? Yes. What in the world? <gasps> Okay, if you go to Wall Drug, you have to go two blocks behind it and come to this place. Oh, it smells good. Oh my goodness. Ooh, this is scary. Yeah, it makes you just feel a little wobbly, huh? Yeah. Excuse me. Could oh. you actually show them what's right? Yeah. Wow. Out here. But this dude. This is like. Whoa! This is two stories high. Oh my goodness. Hey down there. Marshall does not like heights. This place is cool. Oh, should we go back down? Yeah. Okay, be careful. I'm scared. Hang on to the rail when you go down. Oh, that's a big, big foot. Oh, look at these bears. These bears are so friendly. Wow, look at these paintings. What? Look at this. So this place. 
place wasn't here before no. when we were here. She just said that they brought in the big jackalope last fall and they just opened this up just a little bit ago. Wow. A lot of people aren't too sure about wall drug. They just kind of do it because they feel like they should. Yeah. But after they do that, they should pop over here. Exactly. Oh, look at that. Look at it. Look at it. Dolls carving walls, South Dakota. Very cool. So we enjoy wall drug every once in a while because it's just unique and, and weird and funky and fun. But and there are a couple um, of signs along the way to remind you. <laughs> Yeah, you'll see a sign to tell you where it's at. Actually, I just go to Wall Drug for the donuts. Anyway, they do, yeah, because they do homemade donuts every day. He's not a huge fan. I think to him- I go for the free ice water. He goes for the free ice water. I like the homemade donuts. Anyway, not sure where we're going next time, but you guys will be with us. Until then, this is Grassroots Living, reminding you to get down to the grassroots of what makes you happy and live your love. We're thinking of you. We'll catch you next time. Peace out. Viva la vie.